Episode, episode one, one fifty five, sixty. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Yes. What is it? Sixty six. Yeah. <laughs> welcome. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Completely <laughs> unscripted. Yeah, that was finishing each, each other's, other's sandwiches. sandwiches. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So today we have me, Taco, and me, Stan, <laughs> Jason with Concealment Solutions, and Carl with me. With me, yeah, <laughs> with UPS, with my, with COVID. Now I've got this, the, <laughs> antibodies. Sexy voice. I don't know if you know. Stan, I think died, I've though. usurped your sexy voice. Yes, because it did. That. Now it's it's permanent. Okay. Well, so yeah. Like other everything else in my life, it's failed. And we no, you I pass guess. it on to the next there generation. Yeah. So that's what we do. There. Yeah. Excellent. Thanks for thanks for having us, Jason and Taco. Thanks for coming, guys. <laughs> yeah, it's a great time. Yeah. Carl had to, I guess you did too. I did had too. to fight through the eclipse, eclipse track. track. Oh, so yeah. if you've ever heard of eclipse oh, track, it's, it's like no one's ever seen one. Yeah. Everyone blocked up the entire I-15. <laughs> let's go to let's for, go to Southern Utah yeah. for a thirty-second event. Yeah, and well, then turn around. Actually, it was two hours from two and a half hours from beginning to end. Depending on where you were. Okay, so did you guys, like watch did you guys notice the shadows? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No. Yes. The shadows Every are like hole. super oh, trippy. Yeah. Well, it, what it is is it's it's the pinhole effect. You can put a pinhole and then whatever it projects on it, 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 it projects the actual eclipse on it. For, yeah. so for, like, the, for the, those the in the late 1800s that <laughs> want to do this yourself. Hey, hey my wife you did. you got to wait till how many years for yeah. the next one? Yeah. Uh, well, uh, well like least. next year, but you have to go further East. Isn't there supposed to be another one in uh, like 20, 20, 2036 or 2037 and then another one in 2042? You know what? There's, if we make it that far. There's this right? internet thing that you could look on and, and yeah. To, yeah. to see. Yeah. yeah. I've got a picture on my phone. It's, it's I don't the, want to look it's at yeah. it. Yeah. Anyways, I'll post, I'll post a couple of pictures on, on Instagram maybe. Yeah. Hey, all I know maybe. is thank you for all those that, that yeah. traveled to block the road thing. Well, we're so, so starved for entertainment in, the, <laughs> in Utah. And probably surrounding states that it's like, oh, there's going to be a two-hour slow motion <laughs> event, <laughs> something that we can get a picture of off the interweb. Let's drive there. I mean, there's war. Out. There's war everywhere. Yeah. But let's go do that. Yeah. 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 Awesome. Uh, having said that, my four-year-old loved it. My yeah, four-year-old four grand, gr- no, granddaughter. No, I wanted to hear about your four-year-old. <laughs> my four-year-old. Busy. Well, she is yeah. my four-year-old granddaughter. But she she totally ate it up. We bought the glasses and everything, and she was enthralled for yep. about two minutes. <laughs> yeah, <exactly. laughs> okay, I'm done. Yeah. next. Oh, oh yeah, she'll, she'll never get that time back. That was but, the same with us. It was like, oh, here, yeah, it's getting light. <laughs> weird outside. Go outside. Look yeah, at the uh, look. At the, every twenty uh, minutes, would go out and oh, look at it again. Yeah, it's a little further. Yeah, yeah, look at the shadows. Took pictures. It's got some sort of occlusion. Went back <laughs> inside. <laughs> Having yeah. said that, it was an annular uh, eclipse. Not a total eclipse, which is a little more rare. Well, yeah, wrecked them, dang near killed them. <laughs> <laughs> and you look. Oh, and, okay, yeah, I misunderstood. <laughs> so, Let's knock out sponsors really quick. <laughs> NOE Bullet Molds. We are actually in the NOE studio. We have not been here. It's been a while. In a it very has been long a while, time. Yeah. And it's nice. It's nice to be it feels on the like couch home. again. It feels like home. It does. Mm-hmm. It does. Makes me want to cast bullets right mm. now. Yeah, I can see that. Mm-hmm. I, yeah, I, I, I can feel, do it. Yeah, cast totally. bullets. So check out NOE Bullet Molds at NOEBulletMolds.com. When you check out, use the code FLT001, and it'll save a crap ton of money. Yeah, yeah. and if you're not crap cat- ton. <laughs> yeah, if you're not casting bullets, you're not a man yet. Ooh. What if you're just a boy? Then, then you need to cast some bullets, and then it'll make you into a man. I'm a real man. I'm a, I'm a real boy. Then <laughs> my nose grows. There you go. Yeah. Utah Air Guns at utahairguns.com. Go check them out. Use the code AIRCANDY when you check out. You'll get free turret stickers and free shipping. Um, free, excuse me, what kind of stickers? Turret stickers. Oh, turret. <laughs> turret stickers. Turret stickers, okay. Free turret no stickers. No D in there. No D. Turd sticker, turd, turd stickers. Did, that's what you I thought he said. Turd that's sticker. Like, <laughs> I, I didn't sound it out in my in my head. <laughs> yeah, I was doing the same. Like, turret, turret for your turret did turrets on your 
scope. Yes. Right. Turret. Yeah. Stickers. That's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, we have Black Ice Coatings at blackicecoatings.com. Check them out on Instagram, Facebook, and when you need something, call them up and tell them you want it slickery. Oh, yeah. yeah. If you do anything, slickerize your, yeah. your guns. For yeah. sure. The action, the bolt. Yep. Yeah. Like, minimum. It makes That's, a difference. It does. It makes you, it like, slickery. You remember the Han Solo guns that we made? Oh, oh yeah. 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 I was playing around with that yesterday. Yeah. Or not yesterday. Uh, Saturday. Did you shoot it? No. Oh, okay. That's part you of my stuff. You just played around. That's with part it. of my stuff I'm going to talk about. <laughs> As I open up. Okay. This. Okay. Yeah. But Hi, yet. I'm Carl. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, Carl. <laughs> um, Magholder. Magholder.com. Horizontal mag carriers and lots of other stuff. Look at you, Stan, sporting Stan a mag holder. Sporting a mag holder. It's all I present. No offense, Jason. That's okay. I like those for competition, but this is my. I, what, what do they call it? A throwaway mag? So you got the two on your hip, and when you load up... So, like, you'll never use it. If you have to reload, you'll throw that one away. Well, for IDPA or something like that. You keep it in here so that when you load and make ready, it's the first one you put. Right, right, right. Yeah. Yeah. But it never leaves my side. Well, it disappears. Awesome. Would you like to see it? I I couldn't even see it now. I I know. It it does. It's, look, Disappeared. Fat. Fat. Mag holder. (laughs) Fat. (laughs) Fat. Mag holder. Tire. Yeah. There it is. It's gone. When you check out at Mag holder... Dot com, use the code get in the van I have candy, I have candy. Yep. and you will save oh. a bunch of money love you Mark that's <laughs> yeah. never get old that is funny yep and then last but not least concealment solutions at concealmentsolutions.com lots of new stuff on there look oh, at that Stan is oh. just sucking up brand to new Jason ooh brand you have new. one of the belts too I do yeah yeah the python yeah belt the, the belt. python EDC oh yeah I and it is my EDC yeah. And they're new and improved because Jason is making them thicker. They are th- thicker. They are thicker. I'm, I'm practically wearing a shoelace. It's true. <laughs> that <laughs> is That's true. a UPS belt. Yeah. It's a UPS belt, which means crap. And they're, they're saving four cents by making it out of plastic. And yeah. destroying the environment, by the way. Yeah. Yes. But they're doing it harder Yes. Than anyone else. <laughs> so Concealment Solutions. Concealment Solutions. Go check out. Lots of new stuff on there. Um, I sent a friend down there. Oh, yeah? When? Yeah. Uh, Don't just, say yesterday because yes, it wasn't there. It was a couple mm. days ago. Okay. You made a holster, custom one, for his SIG. Oh, SIG. Oh. Love that. Good yeah, choice. Yeah, yeah. tall guy. Good he, choice. It was funny. He, he's like, I was surprised at how short Jason is. <laughs> I said, well, actually, he's the same height as Carl. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I think we measure that. Aren't you an inch taller? Mm. I don't think so. I'm 5'7 I'm on a good day. You're basically. Okay, yes. Then you are <laughs> basically an inch taller. Basically, London. In, in the, the morning, no, no I'm an inch taller. I learned that. I learned that uh, my, you know, visit in the hospital, I shrunk probably an inch or two, and my feet grew. Your six-week vacation? Yes. Oh, Your geez. feet grew. Yeah, my feet grew. I, I've got. I have to get bigger shoes now. Huh. Weird. Yeah. Nothing else grew. I know that you guys were all going to ask that. <laughs> <laughs> nothing. No, else. I was just saying. And, nothing. And nothing and else. Nothing <laughs> else. Yep. Huh. Okay. <laughs> Um, <laughs> what were we talking about? <laughs> see, see, it's been a long time. We're now you know why they don't have us just on. just finished <laughs> yeah. Concealment Solutions. Now you know right, why they don't have right. the gun dudes on it. Use, use coupon code. Use coupon code show me the candy. You'll save 15%. <laughs> nice. Um, one update. So I am almost out of my knives. I have exactly four knives left in three styles. Are and the, these the, the Ukrainian knives? Yeah, the okay. BPS knives. Yeah. Nice. Which you guys all have. Oh, some. they're awesome. Yeah, they are good. Um, and what's funny, I and take I them out and this... just kind of go, shing, <laughs> and put it back in the sheet. You just shing. play around with those. You don't do anything real with them. I do it while I watch Conan, and I have to, you know, like, I quote the, the lines as, as you do. Uh-huh. Like, what is the secret of steel, boy? You know that. <laughs> so. <laughs> and then it, it, Thulsa it, Doom has to give you the answer later on in the movie, but... But I digress. Anyway, <clears throat> I called them to see, check on my order to see if it had shipped yet. Because they take about six weeks after they ship to get here. Uh-huh. has not shipped yet. Wow. Because they're having production issues with the new axe. Oh. So you know what? Did you tell them to ship There's it without the axe? axe. I ordered it's axes. A little, oh, yeah. axes. Yeah, hatchet axes. Like the body spray? Yes, exactly, <laughs> Carl. <laughs> 
Um, well, I wonder, uh, wonder so, if that has anything to do with the Wagner Group. It's the Wagner Group. In Russia, attacking Ukraine. Yeah, you know there's a th- war going on. Yeah, I do know that. I have, I've never heard the name <laughs> Wagner Group before. Uh, I don't, fo- I don't listen to the news. There are contractors. That, uh-huh. uh, the head of it was just, how do they say it? Almost whacked. But no, he was eliminated. Quite. They blew up his plane. Not quite, but he, it was he, like dustified. Something like that. Okay, <laughs> anyway. Let, are sorry. they are they with the Russian side? Russian side. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. But never mind. It's okay. You support who you support. That's okay. <laughs> I'm, like I said, I pay very little attention to the news and what's going on, so I didn't know. Anyway, I, it shouldn't have anything to do with that. These guys, when I originally started ordering from them, I was like, can you guys even get stuff out of the country? Oh, yeah, we ship out every day. Hmm. I'm like, okay. And, the, and they're like, yeah, we just bought a great big generator, so when the power goes out, we can keep running. And wow. They just sneak it in with the uh, wheat shipments that they send out. I, I don't know. With- <laughs> Jason's going to get a crate and be like, what? Oh, I think they mixed it up. I've got cocaine. <laughs> Someone got my knives. Anyway, my point it's is... It's supposed to go to Biden. <laughs> I ordered oh, it. Nice. Hunter, yeah. Nicely done. Yeah. Good play on that. I placed my order so that they would arrive at the end of this month or the first week of November, and now it's looking like it might be around Thanksgiving time if I'm lucky. Yeah, so I may, post, I may put them on there to where you can pre-order them. So that you can get, you know, for sure have what you want for yep. the holiday season and stuff like that. So watch for that. But anyway, check out Concealment Solutions. There's lots of new stuff on the website. I want to know what everyone's carrying today. <clears throat> oh, I'll go first. Yeah, okay. you go. I actually am carrying a brand spanking new dagger. Oh. See, I'm showing you. How many rounds do you have through this that? This is the PSA Maybe dagger. Maybe 100. It's a PSA dagger. I've been impressed with that. Yeah. Um, I like And mine. it costs the proper amount. It's what yes. a Glock should cost. Yes, yeah. I agree. Well, originally, good old Gaston Glock, that was his game plan, was to produce these super cheap guns. And I don't know who it was, if it was somebody in his organization or some somebody came to him and said, no, 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 you need to market this as the newest, greatest space age oh. It most incredible thing out there, and it's not going to well, be. Cheap. She's done well. I, I'm yeah. not saying Glock isn't doing well, but it's overpriced. Yeah. Oh, I, yeah. I've never argued that. Yeah. yeah. But it was a marketing thing that worked. Yeah. yeah. It worked great. And and HK went even above and beyond that. Sure. Yeah. Which HK was the first one to produce a polymer pistol. Mm. Did you be, know that before Glock? Yes. Oh, I did not know that. Yeah. Fascinating. Yes. Fascinating. Anyway, mine's in a brand spanking new. It even <clears throat> smells new. Yes. Uh, Concealment Solutions. Uh, We're not going to smell Cobra. Co- well, on the Cobra belt, but the. <laughs> was it the Cobra? It's a Cobra. Oh, it's the Python belt. Cobra. I've got snakes all over me. Yeah. Ah, snakes! Get them off me! <laughs> <laughs> so I've got a Cobra and a Python. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or no, that's a cougar. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, I'm getting mixed up. Taco, but, what do you got? I I have the air weight. Oh, let me see that. I like a little the air Smith weight. and Wesson. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Three fifty seven. Does that kick at all? Uh, With three se- three fifty seven yes. rounds, yes, it does. No, does it doesn't. Not does at all. It you should all? shoot it, it next time we go. It doesn't kick. It bites. <laughs> <laughs> I think I have. I think I have a video clip of you. It's like. Bang, ow, bang, ow. <laughs> ow, it hurts my hand. Ow, ow. After every shot. I like yeah. the fiber optic front sight, though. Yeah, that yeah. is such a cool gun. You don't have to point it at me. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> that is a cool gun. Yeah, it weighs nothing, though. It's, nice. it's crazy. It's their... It's the, a Scandium. The Scandium yeah. one. I like these. Scandium's nice. I'm getting an un- unobtainium one. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. Even better. Ooh. Yeah. yeah. Well, you can just skip me. I didn't... I just got off work. Yeah, I know. They don't let us carry there, so. That's okay. What's Jason carrying? I. Well, now I'm carrying, uh, you know, Smith & Wesson. <laughs> oh, there you go. There. Now, now he's carrying something. Oh, look at that. I like the PX4. I have Mark on my hip. <laughs> oh, nice. Look at that. My Kimber K6S like that was Gosh. given to me by our good friend Mark, housekeeper. Wow. Literally uh, on his deathbed. Yeah. I felt that... Uh, with our little reunion today, I needed to bring a little something of Mark here. Yeah, a little intelligence, maybe. Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> that's a stretch. <laughs> that's why I brought the guns, yeah, Dan. Right. Uh, precisely my point. Yeah. Kimber K6. But that's a good-looking gun. It Kimber is. makes an, a nice they, revolver. I am Hardwood not grips. a fan of Kimber 1911s. Mm-hmm. 
Their revolvers are amazing. Hmm. And that's what the trigger yeah, the and hammer tr- sounds the, like. Yeah, <laughs> the trigger pull on those is nice. It is, and they lock up nice extremely well. Yeah, and they're, they're the fit and finish on them is just incredible. So, Carl, what are you carrying? <laughs> I actually cannot carry yet. You're supposed to talk about that one. Well, it's a PX4 Storm. I like them. It just needs to be really super aggressive, 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 as they, as they say. It one of my least be. favorite guns. You don't like it? No, mm, I've I, never shot one. I do like them. I don't. What? I don't like the. You can't say you, it's you a, hate them if you sure haven't you can. shot I like them. Have you just... ever made a holster for one? You would hate them too. <laughs> <laughs> They're big and chunky. They. Uh, they've got an interesting uh, rotating bolt on it. That's. Kind of industry you yeah. see, exclusive. You see right here the way the frame drops down right in front so of the look, trigger look guard. In, yeah, yeah. Right here, look, those, the look into the camera. That has to be all filled in and blocked out, ah, or it won't come out why. of a holster. Ah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but it, it's a fun gun. Beretta it needs to be more uh, again aggressive in the grips. Beretta likes to do weird, goofy cuts and detents and stuff in their guns that makes my life very difficult. You it's, just. It seems I'll unnecessarily admit they make great stuff, though. It seems unnecessarily blocky and chunky. Hey, hey, mm-hmm. they're innovating. <laughs> it's not as I'll like it. square chunky as like a Glock. <clears throat> yeah, it's no. more rounded. It's a rounded Glock, is what it feels yeah, like. Yeah, kind of. Yeah. <laughs> it's a round Glock. Yeah, okay. With a rotating barrel. Yes. Yeah. Rotating which, locking barrel. Which you you notice if you look at it, but yeah, it's a it's a round Glock. A Glock is a 2 by 4 with a crappy angle. You know, the I've never had an issue with the grip angle. Me neither. It, I do because like, I go well, between 1911s and Glocks. I used to also, and I've never had an issue. Oh. I've never understood what people are talking about. <laughs> I'm like... I do it all the time. We're, we're like humans, and we're made to be adaptable, I thought. Yeah. No. But nope, yeah. same thing. <laughs> That's why they're different guns. Yeah. Yep. So you can choose the one you like. Yeah. The Beretta 92 oh is God. just a gun that, like... <laughs> I do, too. <laughs> <laughs> I do too. That's the Biden whisper. You've yeah. got it down. Thanks. You got to sniff his hair first. Oh. <laughs> get get real close. <sighs> yeah. I I do too. <laughs> it's working. The Beretta ninety two. The Beretta ninety two. That's one that is is kind of funny because I don't love the trigger pull on it. Uh-huh. Yeah. But I shoot it really well. Yeah. I don't I don't know why, but. It's. I've been. See, well, it, I'll say. Yeah. I've, anyways, mine's kind I've of never it's, liked the Beretta ninety two or the A one, whatever. Same thing. Just mm-hmm. ones. The M nine A one. Yeah. In fact, I had one for a couple of days. And I never shot it before yeah. I sold it. You've had every gun. Yeah. I've had a days. lot, but since they retired it from our military use, mm-hmm. now I want. Now you want one. <laughs> Actually, I'm kind of switching to. No, I'll save this for what we're doing with Okay. For later on. Let's jump into a news story. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> and now, the news. Thanks. Uh, yeah. Okay, this from Memphis, Tennessee. Been there. I just went through there. Excellent. One of the owners of a North Memphis restaurant says she was forced to shoot a naked intruder who <laughs> oh. threatened her and her family members inside the North Hollywood business late Monday night. I was on Ambien. Sorry. <laughs> the woman, who did not want to be identified by name, said the man dressed only in sneakers. I mean... Yeah, it was me. That was who, me. Yeah. <laughs> who hasn't? Let's be honest. Yep. Um, That's Thursday at my house. <laughs> <laughs> dressed only in a pair of sneakers, showed up to Mr. Potato Head. <laughs> What's asking, That's the name of the asking restaurant? Asking for water and managed to push his way inside, shutting the self-locking doors behind him. <laughs> As you do, politely. I'm, yeah. So I'm thinking, I mean, who hasn't gone to their favorite restaurant dressed up like the mascot? Mr. Yeah. Potato Head. Oh, that's right. Yeah. But naked. Yeah. But he has tennis shoes and a mustache and glasses well, sometimes. no shoes, no service. You know, that's my, right. my, yeah. my reoccurring nightmare, actually. But I show up at school with no clothes on. Yeah. So. You know, you know I have the same that? dream, but it's not a nightmare. Yeah. Oh. The way to overcome that. <laughs> this one again. Yes. Stan, Stan, the way to overcome that nightmare is yeah. to just do it. Get just it do it. Uh, exposure yeah. therapy. Just exposure. Yeah. Oh, gotcha. Okay. Literally exposure therapy. Gotcha. She said the man became enraged when he couldn't leave the restaurant, <laughs> began damaging property, and jammed the doors trying to get out. So now he's trapped. She said he also punched her in the chest and continued to oh. come toward her even though she was holding a gun. 
I was just afraid of his strength, she said. I'm pointing at him, asking him to calm down and stay away or get out of the store, which the door was jammed, and he had no way out. So, therefore, I was between a rock and a hard place. <laughs> Get it. <laughs> Got it. And I just did what I had to do, she said. The woman said she fired one shot at the man when he charged her and shot him again when he picked up a chair to throw at her sister. It's just After a, being shot. Boy, she waited yeah. a long time. That's she, a very kind, patient lady. Yes. It's just a scary sight, and I know that people are saying uh, what they could have on. done... <laughs> What they would have done, but until you're in a situation, you never know what you will do, especially when the fear hits you. You never know what you're going to do. He was a big guy, big enough to hurt me, she said. The woman's sister, who began live streaming after the shooting, said the man was like a lion locked in a cage. (laughs) (laughs) Live streaming, of course. (laughs) Wow. She Uh. said when they called the police, the naked man was on the ground, and she and her sister and brother were still locked inside the restaurant. She... She said she went on Facebook to let loved ones know what was happening. Oh, God. Remember when you used to just call people? Yeah. yeah. Or even just send them a text? Jason, back in my day, we <laughs> used to write letters. Yes. Well, they didn't have the, the Facebook. And smoke signals. In we don't stand. Yeah. <laughs> just saying. Sometimes the, the, the lights with the shutter yeah. on the roof. Yeah, yeah. yeah. On, the Twitch, <clears throat> on the Twitch fire. Yes. App. Uh, if the police came in and arrested us or anything, my family needed to know. Somebody needed to know where we were or what was going on with us. Memphis police said a man was transported to the hospital in critical condition and later died. Oh. They said a woman was detained but haven't released any details about the shooting. Was it? The woman fatal? who fired the shot <laughs> said she was taken into custody but is not facing any charges. She said she never wanted to take another life. Of course not. Uh, and mm. this is where it kind of Yeah, gets you never sad. want to take a life. No. This is, I am not a monster. It's a bad day. I would never hurt anybody purposely, unless they're trying to throw a chair at you and they're only wearing sneakers. Yeah, and you fear for your life. Right. I just feared for my life, and I just did what I thought I was supposed to do, she said. I didn't want him to die or anything like that. I just didn't want to be the one my mom had to claim to identify. Uh, yeah. The sisters said they recognized the man from the neighborhood. Police have not identified him yet. So, yeah. And I think that's pretty much, you could sum up a lot of self-defense shootings the same way. People are just trying to keep themselves and their families safe mm-hmm. and, you know, being forced to do things that they would not otherwise like to do. Yeah, we shouldn't be, su- I mean, she shouldn't have been submitted to that. And yeah. It's, it's certainly not fair. Right. Well, it could have been <laughs> enjoyable. Sorry. <laughs> wow. Well, he might have been a handsome man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to look at the good side of it. She this. specifically said it frightened her. <laughs> yeah. She feared for her life yeah, and some, the life of her Some of us are family. just, you know. You're just an more, optimist. More manly. You're, you're just an optimist. <laughs> the glass half full. No. Okay. That's too bad. That's uh, That's horrible. That's hard to hear. We have some snacks still that Mark from Hawaii sent us, and I mm-hmm. think we should do a round of snacks. <laughs> you want you want us to eat on the podcast? I do, and we're wow. going to start. How many times? Have, stop hey, eating. Hey, you folks stop enjoy eating. this. Yeah. <clears throat> Actually, we did have some listener feedback after the last episode, and the guy's like. Yeah, that was totally reminding me of my childhood and the <laughs> snacks we see. And that's what Mark said when he said, he's like, these are all snacks that I ate when I was a kid and everything. And all I have to say to you two is, I'm sorry that you had such a horrible childhood. <laughs> <laughs> really? Okay, you guys ready for it? Yeah. We'll start what? with these ones. Okay. No. What is it? Wasabi? You, you, have no, you have no, like, nut allergies. Wasabi. <laughs> Wasabi. Wasabi. <laughs> These are good, man. Yeah, a couple more, a couple. Well, uh, one more. Stan. Okay. Just, just I love these. Okay. I you do had like those wasabi. before? Oh, yeah. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Wasabi. It'll clear out your uh, sinus. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's all I need. Wasabi peanuts. Mmm. Good. These oh, are already hot. <laughs> Carl. <laughs> I got a baby we're gonna let We're, we're going to go with some shredded Ica. It's Japanese style squid. Nope, no, oh my no. God. Nope. Yes. Not squid. Oh, come on, you babies. No, it's a wasabi. Oh, no, wasabi's mm. killing him. Dude, give me some, yeah, give me some <laughs> squid. I've got a baby mouth. I can't. The, in, the ingredients on the shredded Ica mm-hmm. first ingredient is squid. Mm. Second ingredient is sugar. Sugar. Then salt. Mm-hmm. 
And then a bunch of like preservatives. Well, stuff. I'm in. I'm in. All right. What I'm trying to figure out is why. Why would you eat this as why? a snack? Yeah, Mark, why? Mark, do you need me to send you some like beans and rice, something palatable? <laughs> okay, All so right. this is. I'm gonna take a little bit. That's take not a little some bit. And pass it it looks like shredded chicken or it, like. It looks like cheese. It looks like string cheese. Yeah. It's already been stringified. Okay. I don't like this episode. <laughs> I'm already not happy. Okay, the texture is like really old string ah, cheese. Ah. Come on, Carl. Man it's, up. It's way better with a wasabi, a wasabi peanut combo. Mm. It's like I'm eating dry fish. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's what it tastes like. Yeah. Sugary dried fish. I'm not tasting the sugar. I'm not getting a really sweet taste to it. You're not? I just no. some like some some like we have this it's from where I'm from called Sour Patch Kids. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Great right. thing. Mm. Okay. This next, this next one. Yeah, that t- tastes like sweet fish. <sighs> we're gonna, we're yeah. gonna mix it up. It's not bad. No. no. I, I honestly thought that was gonna be horrible, and I I'm think, not hating okay. it. My palate has definitely changed because all, all I eat is hamburger patties yeah, and you know, wasabi eggs. chicken. <laughs> and that's it. Give me another one. Okay, okay. Okay. The next one is gonna be the noms. Nom 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 nom. And it's pineapple belts covered in. Li Hing and lemon peel. Does anyone Ooh. have any urine that can just <laughs> cleanse the palate? <laughs> Here, have some more wasabi. <laughs> <laughs> the wasabi will do. Oh, that's good. Well, actually, I, I actually like those. Yeah. The squid is delicious if you have it with a wasabi uh, peanut. <laughs> so kids eat that? Really? Apparently. <laughs> What's a nom? You know, we don't eat a lot of fish it's in like, the United States. Hey, now, you, you gotta remind, I love remind the listeners that he, he this is from Hawaii. Yeah. So he was oh, in Hawaii. Geez. Okay, what is this? Nom nom. It's just nom pineapple belt thing. Covered in ling hang, mm. whatever. It's, okay, do any of these have sugar? <laughs> oh, that's delicious. What? That's candy. What? Yeah. Pineapple. It's pineapple. It doesn't, it, you should taste no, it. No, I love pineapple. I have a lot of pineapple. You don't like that? I just stop at every truck stop and grab a cup of pineapple. No, no, actually those good. are outstanding. Yeah, those are. Te- yeah, that's tasty. Nom nom nom. I could eat those all day. It's okay. Okay. I'm, I'm gonna give it okay. That's about it. Just so you guys know, Carl just peeled off like maybe the a pinhead size oh, piece not even, of it. it. Barely. Of the pineapple? Yeah. It's not pineapple. It's not real. It is Stan, real. It's, it's delicious. It's not real, Stan. All right. Oh, no. All right. Jason, what you got? Dried lemon peel. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No, this is gonna be good. In the Dominican Republic, they used to do. Uh, Grapefruit and that's a whole, that's like looks like it's a whole lemon. Grapefruit yeah, and uh, orange peel. Either but they would candy it. Either that or it's a scrotum. I'm not. No, <laughs> that's what it looks like. No. I mean, you guys would know more, but <laughs> really, smell it. <laughs> All right, it's, this might be a tough one. I didn't think Here, this one would be that bad. It, is this? <laughs> Is this mold on it? Uh huh. It smells like a department store. Nope. No. Oh, yes. You know what? Yes, a department store. Yeah, it does. It smells like a department Mark, store. Mark, you need to come live with us. <laughs> You've been abused, man. <laughs> That's not right. Do they eat that on purpose? You know, it, it doesn't taste terrible. It doesn't taste bad. It smells it, like a department it store. It smells. Though. Are you guys getting the good well, stuff? Well, let me let me read the oh, the slogan. Oh. Yep. Nope. It's, hey. It, okay, it's got a. Oh. It's got an <laughs> oh man, that took a second to kick in. Whoa. Oh. He's he's Ooh. punk. He's punking us with oh. this. Why? Because he sent this to us and watch. We're, I'm oh. gonna get those guys to eat this. <gasps> I'm it sure. says it's time to enjoy life. Exclamation point. Yeah. All right. Who's life? Hey, next, respect- next up, we gotta do these honeydew can. Respectfully, uh, yeah. The, oh. the lemon peel. No, I just I don't get it. Did you taste it? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Here, you can have some wine. It's it's delicious. Ah. All right. So these ones that are. Was, that one was a little rough. Milk. Milkita. 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 Well, is it supposed to be like antibiotic, um, probiotic stuff? Is oh it? man, it still tastes like salty, it gross says, on my teeth. I think this is supposed to be taken rectally. <laughs> It's like an analgesic or something. Is that how you pronounce it? No, analgesic doesn't mean... <laughs> that means rectal. you take it rectally. <laughs> oh, where'd it go? Under your chair. Oh, wait, analgesic, you're right. <laughs> Lemon peel, it's analgesic. These are milkita. Okay. Tastes like milky I can't get my candy. <laughs> Carl, okay. do you need some help? I do, I do. It's super Ooh. bland. It's like milk. It's no. 
Milk candy. Yeah, I'm getting the milk. I'm okay with it. Hey, do green. you guys like ginger? Hey. I love ginger. Yeah. Okay. It, it wasn't stored in someone's shorts, so I'm okay with it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, those lemons. Sweet Lee Hing ginger. Okay. It it basically it looks like candy ginger, what, which what's is it, delicious. What's it leaking? Leaking? Mm. <laughs> Yeah, that does take. You taste like milk, like like you might be yeah, concentrated after milk. You try it. Oh, like that's, condensed milk or something. Yeah, that's interesting. You guys know a little I'm, bit of sugar in it. Guys, I was a an ICU patient <laughs> for six months, and you're doing this. Did you almost die? I did. Wow. I think it's coming back. Well, I almost, almost. <laughs> I haven't almost died in a long time. Ooh, these smell good. Do they? Yeah. Case of the ginger one. Mm-hmm. Hold on. Mm. <laughs> Are you having to cleanse, Jason? Uh huh. Hey, there's a doctor. Oh, in the, the milk really got you? No, no it's, it's the ginger one. It wasn't one. bad. It just. Stan, there's a Dr. Pepper in there. It was just <laughs> I know. Too long. These, these <laughs> ginger things look like earplugs. Yeah. Used earplugs. Mm, <laughs> earplugs. <laughs> Let's see what they taste like. Okay. Stan, ginger. You need a Dr. Pepper chaser? No, I'm good. Mm. It's, I, it's, a, it's fresh. No. I dropped it in my lap like only. Th- I actually like this one. That's good. Woo! It's got some kick to it, though. Yeah. Like, I love candied ginger. Mm. This isn't as sweet as the stuff you get no. in real America. No. no. Guys, what's wrong with you? <laughs> Tastes. Oh, Tastes It's pretty potent. It no. is. Is it? Yep. <laughs> Did you? Yeah, all right. I ate a whole one. You chew it up and stuff? Yeah. No, yeah, it's not Did, strong at all. I was joking about the analgesic. <laughs> you don't have to do it that way. It's, uh, it's called a right. suppository. Last, last one, and we'll get on with the show. <laughs> nope. No, that, wait, what's oh. the red one? You've got one, a red one, the mango one. Okay, let's, no, let's, 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 let's do this. Let's do this one. So okay. This is the high temp, tempura. It's tempura seaweed. Seaweed. Yeah. <laughs> that can't be bad. <laughs> it can't. I mean, like fried I, seaweed. I yeah. like a little bit of sashimi. Okay, yeah. But I'm still trying to understand the whole. You seaweed guys know thing. I pee blue, right? I love seaweed. this stuff. Tastes good. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's a chip. It's a crisp. Oh, mm. that's delicious. Yeah. Yeah. I could like eat a whole bag of this. Like, yeah. Okay. Like that's good. sitting in front okay, of not it. on not on purpose. When I had say some it's not sour great. cream and cheese ruffles or something like that, <laughs> and that something I think I'd go for the chips. Right? I think I'd even go for uh, tortilla chips. Hmm. Oh, but yeah, they're not tasty. bad. No. Like I actually like them. No, I think all right. Tasty. Here's some dried. I've always wanted to go to Hawaii. Leehing mango. No, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> mango with no, plum right. powder. With what? Plum powder. Plum powder. Plum powder. Okay, this like so, it's. it's Kind of like one giant. I eat fruit, fruit and I eat meat, and that's it. Do so you this, want this little nubbin? No, I'll, I'll take a bigger oh, oh, you're going to be brave. I'm gonna, well, it's mango. Yeah. How bad can mango be? Yeah, you can't go wrong with yeah, that. mango. Yeah, mango. He's right. got plum powder. Yeah, I love mango. Mm. What's plum powder? Nope. Powdered plum? Nope. Nope. <laughs> you don't like it? Do they, nope. It's an interesting combination. It's not. I think that's delicious. Are we just spoiled here? Well, it's just covered sugar. sugar. Yes. That must be where it is. This I mean, is super sweet. I know. No, it is. It's not sweet. It is sweet. It is. It's my, my taste buds dead. So the plum, uh-huh. the, the plum is a little tart. A little bit. Yeah. Adds a little tart note to it. Oh, good. It's they not are good. It's not quite like an um, umeboshi plum. Those Japanese real bitter. Mm. Oh. But mm. it's, it's it's bitter. It's more bitter than sweet. Okay, that I could eat. Yeah, those are good. Mm. I think I'd take the uh, Costco plum, uh, mango stuff bet over this. Yeah, I wouldn't. Really? Yeah, yeah those mm. would give me a headache. Mm. Well, you're supposed to eat them. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's okay. That's mm. Yeah, that one's not bad. Mango is really good. I'm calling Uncle. <laughs> okay, <laughs> Carl's so let's, done. let's rate him. The squid, I'm saying I'm the sa- squid was. I expected that to be horrifying, and it wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't bad. It was fish. It was it was dried odd. fish. It's dried fish. Yeah. The, the dried lemon peel. Uh, dried I think I think we got a bad batch because it looks like it, it, they have mold on it. <laughs> yeah. It tasted like mold. the dried lemon peel was. Or or is hard. it penicillin? We've all got an immune boost. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That lemon peel, for real. It was was that the one that like department that, store? That's mm-hmm. department store. Yeah. Yeah. That. Because the aftertaste smelled like a department yeah, store. Yeah, the smell Except was the, not good. 
the taste was was actually pretty good okay. until and you then, got to the end, and then it and like then it's potent. No, it yeah, there, there was no flavor to it at all. It, like really? if we leave it in the room here, <laughs> they're gonna think someone's died. <laughs> so I'm saying he sent that one as a just sort of a prank, the lemon peel. All the oh, others Mark, are was that a prank, or do you, <laughs> Mark? We want to know, and any of you <laughs> listening who have had any of these snacks, Ooh, if one? these are like some of your favorite like things, male coconut ball. I want to know if you guys like these and what, which ones you like, and why. Mark, I think that at least taste-wise, I feel like someone needs to fart so I can breathe. <laughs> 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 Mm. I like the coconut balls too. Yeah, they're, delicious. They're okay. If you like coconut, they're yeah. They're I good. love oh, coconut. coconut balls. I, I don't mm, love yeah, coconut. Right. Mm. It's okay, if, as long as it's not fishy coconut. Yeah. Well, there's there's fish eye in the middle of it. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> oh, there it is. It's coconut and diarrhea. <laughs> Why? Do we do all right. But sincerely, thank you. Yeah. Mark is super generous. Okay. I got I to gotta borrow some of this stuff, take it home to okay. the kids, see, have them try it out. That'll okay. Be funny. I'd like to take uh, yeah, one of the squid That lemon stuff, though, man. I don't yeah. you're going to no. like. No, you, that's what you Coconut have to balls, take. <laughs> awesome. Everything else, crap. Nah, the seaweed chips were good. Those were yeah. good. No, I, I would eat like, those. There's like not very many. Bag. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Taco I've been, been snacking on them. They're like really good. Yeah. Um. Okay. All right, let's let's go around with what we did with guns or, oh, yeah. or other things. Since I didn't do anything with guns, but I did stuff with other things. I've had it interesting. <laughs> yeah. It, my my okay. Part of why I don't carry a gun right now. Yeah. Is because you know in my recovery, my uh, brain has just cleared up. I'd say over the past four months. Yeah. So I'm like. It's great. It's, it's it's smart that I have not carried, but that's why. Yeah. Because I I'm like I shouldn't be allowed at all. I honestly, if I now I can say this now, I probably shouldn't have been allowed to drive a semi truck. <laughs> that's scary. Yeah, huh. it really is. Yeah. Like, I ca- <laughs> Stan's as, like, huh? As far as memory, yeah. brain fog, like I don't know how I've done it. Four months on, I've been amazingly great, uh, and even better. A new guy moved into my neighborhood. A great guy. And we got just one of those things where stuff slips out, where you get talking, and everyone kind of tests each other out. Yeah. Where you you don't want to mention guns, that you're a gun guy, and like, but then someone says something. You oh, just, I thought you were going with swing. It starts <laughs> swinging. <laughs> Pineapple sure, yeah, on the doorstep. Uh-huh. Hey, do you like someone looks like a hairy child? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> That's me. No, but just kind of licks out, and Masada Yub name came in. What, what, what? And just immediately, attention. I don't remember. He said it, I said it, and... Yeah, I've got, I've, uh, I think I've got Gail's number in my phone still, you know, and Mass is, you know Mass and Gail? I'm like, Mass and Gail and Masada, <laughs> you've been Gail Pepin. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and it just kind of went from there. And he's, uh, Well, he's actually, like Tom, is an instructor for, for the Masada, you group. So right. is he. Awesome. Yes. Uh, what are the odds? It, well, it, it's, and he's like, oh, have, have you shot the course at four times speed? No. No, I have not. Matter of fact, just regular speed was good, and now I don't do anything. We gotta get you carrying. When are we going out? When are we going out? And he just he keeps keeps saying it every time we talk. I'm like, all right, fine, I'm ready now. Yeah. So now, and you guys know how I am. I have a problem with guns, so I can't go out until I buy a new gun. Mm-hmm. So I'm just trying to pick which one I want. <laughs> I've handled the Sig Legion. Oh. Nice. Yeah. I like, but you know how much I like SIGs. I, I'm the same way. But I, I love SIGs. But I already have Attack Ops. Right. So and it's very similar to that. So uh, he actually has one that I really like, which makes me want to buy the SIG P320 and put it in a Wilson Combat yeah. frame. I want that. Have you made any holsters for those? Yes. Very awesome. Very comfortable. There are tons the 320 is becoming the Glock. Is is no, it is becoming the AR of oh, yeah. the which is the Glock of world. The handguns, really. Because it's it's so modular. And, I love that. And everybody's making aftermarket stuff for them. Um, the same thing is happening with the P365s. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Wilson, Wilson makes makes, yep. makes a grip module for that. And so I, I'm oh, I'm leaning nice. towards uh, because he, he's like, well, here, let's get you out. Let's get you out and do the Masada uh, Masses uh, qualifier. Here, let's get you out there. I'm like. All right. It's all right. The, uh, FBI all right. FBI call course is what it is. Yeah. So I'm 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 excited about that. Uh, I've avoided it just because of the lungs, but I've been yeah. testing that. And the lungs are doing a lot better. If I can handle breathing in argon, uh, 
which I did, and it hurt like crazy. Huh. Uh, but I, I lived, so I'm like, okay, I can do this. But uh, it's probably the Sig P320 or that VP9. VP9s Gosh, are that. fantastic. I know, I love that gun. I, I really like the VP9. I've got my old well. ones. I could do one of those. I, I've been, I really want to shoot uh, Mark's gun. But I just, I'm like, I usually I don't care. It could be John the Wayne's gun. Yes. It could be John Wayne's gun. Mm-hmm. Historic. And I'll be like, yeah, you got to shoot it. Yeah. Mark's is hard. Really? I don't want to shoot it. I, 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 I do. Right just as long as I you don't reload for it. You'll and, be fine. And that's my thing, is I will not. <laughs> no shotgun I know. bullet loads. No, with it, a, it will get nothing but store-bought, only the finest. Or you can come over to my place and reload under actually, adult supervision. Actually, uh, a friend of mine, he's going to help me get going on and everything. But, yeah, uh, Martin now. His name's Martin. Yeah. But he's, he's like, oh, yeah, we'll, we'll get you shooting the qualifier. Four times speed. Sure. Okay. Wow, that's so, yeah, impressive. I'm excited. I mean, I can't. I haven't been able to. I he haven't even seen Tom. Yet. I know. Okay. I haven't even seen Tom just because of uh, all of our schedules are so bad. So I'm he like, was supposed okay. to be a neighbor here. would be perfect. Yeah. He was supposed to be here tonight, and he canceled he last canceled. minute. Well, not last minute. Yesterday afternoon, he texted me. And he could uh, make dang it. it. Yeah. Yeah, it would have been fun to get everybody together. It but been. Uh, that's what I've got going. So I've got to get that, and then I'll be back in the game shooting again, shooting. Cool. So I'll probably be calling Jason for a holster for, it depends on what it is. It's either the VP9 or it's going to be uh, the Sig Legion or it's going to be the 320 or the dagger. I don't know. I like that dagger, but no. I was looking at the Palmetto State Armory's 5.7. Uh, <laughs> uh, rock? Because I can reload those are, those are actually pretty nice. Because I, I can reload it. Yeah. I, I'm What's really trigger? tempted to get that. Uh, well, it's been a while since I shot it, but it I just a, remember a, a shot. Blockish trigger. It or? was like way better than the five seven, the FN five seven. Well, but the PSA five seven, before it'd be like, well, the ammo is expensive and that. I yeah. bought a few, you know, bricks as, I, as you go. But I'm like, well, if I'm gonna get it, I'll just go talk to Taco and then I can just reload it and be fine. Yeah. If you're gonna shoot it, shoot it, get yeah. into it. So I thought, and the Palmetto State Armory. I don't know what the crap they're doing. Man, they got so many good deals. I think they're, they're making it hard. I think they're a nonprofit organization. <laughs> yes, they're get, they're practically giving it away. So yeah. how can you not? So yeah. yeah, now I'm I'm finally back. So that'll be the next thing. Next time you hear me, it, it'll be this is how I did. Haven't shot a gun since the you know, <laughs> since the hospital. So yeah, you're gonna suck. Well, he's asking me if I, well, are you carrying? I'm like, I, I, I won't. Masada Ayub's classes, if you ever go to those, Mag 40 and that, yeah. scares the crap out of you. You're like, I will, I, you know, that whole responsibility that goes with yeah. it, it just freaks you out. So I'm like, no, don't trust myself yet until I can, you know, pass a qualifier. Yeah. So yeah, yeah you got to you got to get some rounds down range. <clears throat> that's it. Yeah, that's because exactly it. If you haven't shot in that long, yes, you're gonna suck. I know like, for real. I know that's what, and I, it, that's why he keeps hounding me, and he's right. So I'm like, all right, I'm in. All right, fine, <laughs> fine, you won, Uncle. And what a good way to say Uncle. Nice. Not your other way. Remember, you remember, <laughs> you were there. <laughs> cool. Um, I'll go next. I have not done much with guns other than. The end. Building. <laughs> hey, thanks for joining us. Building lots of holsters. I, I make some holsters for uh, the Desert Eagle 50 AE. Wow. A drop leg and a chest holster. Nice. For, for two same? different people for the same gun. Wow. Yeah. And those are, I posted pictures of that. So that was, that was interesting. But um, I spent all day yesterday at Blade Show West up in Salt Lake. Which was cool because I get to hang out with Master Bladesmiths yeah. and and stuff. I was there, um, Eric Fritz from Eric or Fritz Custom. I Eyes. remember. Yeah, he was saying, "Tell those guys they need to come." He's a long time gun dude. Oh, I know. Oh, and, poor and guy. He gave us one. Poor guy. A neck knife. Yeah. Nicest knife I had. I had it stolen out of my stinking truck. I remember that. Okay. Yeah. For for the record, I bought those from him. And I gave those to you. Oh, guys. Well, you did. Well, thank you. <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure so, it was he wanted us to have. So what I'm trying to say is, Jason, I need another one. Now, <laughs> no. the way the way my relationship with him started was he had been trying to get a hold of any of you guys, especially Tom, for mm-hmm. some reason. Mm-hmm. None of you were for some res- reason. None of you <laughs> would respond. Asked. To emails or anything. Oh, we're and so he, we live in a brown truck. That's he contacted thing. me, and he sent me like an eight-inch custom 
handmade oh. Bowie oh. knife that he made. It's like a six hundred plus dollar knife, and he said, "I'm gonna send this to you, and it's for you. You can have it, but you have to do one thing." I'm like, "Okay, what do I need to do?" He said, "You need to show it to Tommy and tell him." This would have been your knife if you would have responded to an email. <laughs> and I did that on the show. And Tommy just had this look on his face. That where crestfallen. He was crestfallen, crestfallen yes. but he was doing everything he could to not show it. Really? <laughs> it was well, pretty satisfying. So you can look up email on your phone? <laughs> That's pretty much how bad we were, yes. I've, I've, I've heard. Yep. <laughs> anyway, check, check that out. Anyway, so I've, I've hung out with him. I picked up a few knives, which I, I went there and I'm like, I'm not buying anything. In fact, I had a, a big order for a customer that I was meeting up there to drop off. And originally, I was going to meet him in the morning, and then we changed to the afternoon. He said, Oh, but if you want, if you want to get paid before that, that we can do it in the morning still. And I'm like, No, I don't want the money. <laughs> I'll just spend it on knives that don't, I don't need. Don't you know how we are? Yeah. <laughs> I, I still ended up spending way more than I should have, but I got some really cool knives. Yeah. This I can't remember it's the, the name of it. It's a it's a Boker Plus. It is about a half an inch wide. The whole thing just bigger than a pen. I, I would say a little bit bigger that's than a pen. Six inches. Carbon fiber scales, and it's it's like the most low profile flipper I've ever seen. What's awesome about this knife? <laughs> We're all reaching for it. I I, I bought that for thirty bucks. And I went and I looked it up on their website. I'll give you thirty-one right now. Uh, Thirty-two. It's hundred and thirty bucks on their website. I think they had it marked wrong. <laughs> <laughs> well, don't you feel? Don't you feel dishonest now? No, not even a little bit. Taking advantage of people. That's it's, amazing. It's just a beautiful little. What a great knife. Great. Anyway, knife. for the listeners, it's a it's a knife. <laughs> knife with a blade that protrudes from the hand. I got another one that was a that I like was a pretty one. sweet deal from a company nice. I'd never heard of before. Looks called, like a razor blade. Called um, the kids free comes. In. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice. It's uh, artisan cutlery. That's okay. the name of them. And this one's got G10 scales. It's a flipper also, but it's significantly larger. And I loved it because the blade looks like a straight razor. Straight razor, yeah. And, and it's, Ow, it's, oh. it's, yeah. it's, it's D2 tool steel. Wow. Yeah, so it, it should be pretty you gotta, rugged. On a clean shaven face, just start <laughs> going down your cheek and like, he's out there, bound them trees. It's like a predator. Oh. Jesse Ventura. <laughs> no, it was the other. No, Jesse oh. Ventura was dead by then. Oh, okay. <laughs> Stan, oh. pay attention to the movies. Oh, sorry. And then That's movie really quotes. Cool too. The first knife that I ended up with. So last year when I was down there, I met two of his friends that are both master bladesmiths. Which you have to go through all kinds of testing and everything to get that classification. Mm-hmm. And last year, one of them. Um, Is it, these are Jedi knife makers then. Basically. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Jedi Bill, Masters. Bill Jedi Burke. Master. If you're if you're into knives, you'll probably recognize the name Bill Burke. Anyway, he I traded him a bunch of holsters for a kitchen knife that I still don't have. Ooh. It's done, and he was going to bring it, but he had some issues. Came up, he couldn't come, so I didn't get my knife. Mm. Um, Where does he live? We'll go get him. He's yeah. in Boise. A mile, yeah, well, I'm, I'm 40 miles away every day. Okay. Yeah. Just tell him to drop by. I'll be at the pilot. Okay. Mountain home. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Basically, wait, wait, wait a mountain Henry, home, folks. <laughs> Henry Torres out of California is another master smith that I met just last year. Drop. Hung out with just him a little bit, and I ended up picking oh, up one, I know. one oh, of his knives. He's a master gun um, I, This is a, a kukri knife. It's, well, it looks like it. It's not a kukri. It's a big knife. It's, it, it's, it's like a, kind of. It's just it's, a It's got a little bit of a, of a swept blade. Um Curly maple handle. Mm, I like that. It's an absolutely beautiful thing. Three ninety. These are what's called works of art. Three ninety five. Yes. It says Henry on it. Is his name Henry? Yeah, I started this part of the story. Oh, that's with, what you said. It's Henry. Henry Torres. Oh, okay. Usually, Usually it'd be me. There was some. Painted. There was a barrage of name drops <laughs> dropping there. I didn't pick uh-huh. out the the Henry part. Anyway, and that's the MS beautiful. is uh, M- MS. Yeah, there's an MS stamped on the other side. I'm like Henry. What's the MS for? He's like Master Smith. He's like that makes it collectible. Mm. <laughs> oh, okay. Wow, that is. What kind of steel is that? That is fifty two one hundred uh, ball bearing steel. Well, it's all ball bearings. It is these days. days. Yeah, that one is. 
<laughs> it's cool though. It has the forge markings. Yeah. You, know? mm-hmm. you get some Presto Manny. He makes some beautiful Ooh. stuff. Quaker State. Make it Quaker State. Make it Quaker State. <laughs> but anyway, that's what I did. And I was there scouting. I want to. I want to pick up another line of, of knives. So I want to get some folders and. I think you should start like making them in your spare time. Just. Um. Actually, I have a little bit. Are, are you a apprentice? Eric, Eric actually sent me some blanks of one of his little EDC knives nice. like I gave you. Yes. Um, to finish and make on my own. So Very I just cool. haven't had time to So you, you are an artisan. And uh, for everybody that doesn't know Jason, if it can be made, he'll make it. It's what I we call like a renaissance man. Yeah, renaissance. <laughs> anyway, I will... I, will I think I would have bought one of those knives, but it'd have to be like that model, but times Five or something like bigger, so like yeah. like See, a kookery, basically. Yeah, yeah. Basically. And if I had it my way, it would. I, love I would have, have this be about an inch, inch and a half shorter. That's mm. what she said. It would have been. <laughs> <laughs> it, that it, in my mind, that size knife is a uh, perfect size for uh, processing a deer, yeah, or elk yeah, or whatever. Nice. This is a little. I'd want big. it for like Just, kind of more bushcrafting, but yeah. survival. I say, but on the back of that with a. Yeah. It, it yeah, can handle be. it. Hmm. Beautiful. Anyway, love it. Love it. So oh, that's what you did with guns. To this it is okay. It is. I had a gun <laughs> on me the whole time. Awesome. <laughs> what, which gun was it? It was my Sig P365. P365 with a in a Cobra holster. Proper in a Cobra ways. with a python. Sigs are proper. Of course, with a python. And was it a, uh, a Wilson Combat Grip? On your 365? I'm not that fancy. Oh, that is so yesterday. (laughs) Just using the regular scene. It's it's 100% stock. Oh, that is so so yesterday. What did you do with guns, Stan? Well, I... (laughs) Actually, Grandpa's dream was fulfilled today. Um, I showed you that little cricket. Oh, yeah, yeah. So you got your, your... Yeah, you said it's a child's model. It fit me fine. I know, it fit you perfect. <laughs> you were... Yeah. So that's my, my, my little my little four-year-old. Uh, Stan who, is passing around pictures. You yeah, just so you know. Here. That's about all she could do. She can reach... Couldn't, uh, How old is she again? Four. Four, four years, old. years old. Got to go shooting. Well, uh, four and a half. So is this, this is her gun. This is her gun. This yeah. is awesome. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and uh, it's, gave her a cricket. Uh, I wanted it an NRA ba- crappy I, grandpa. I, oh, yeah, that's right. I remember you won this. I wanted it yeah. at an NRA banquet. It probably cost me four hundred dollars. <laughs> all the tickets I put <laughs> all the tickets in. Tickets yeah. you, put you know, over the years, and finally yeah. I won one. But uh, actually, I, it was I took Sadie and uh, Cheryl went. And we mm-hmm. did the dueling tree, and she had her lever gun, and uh, and Ellie showed up. We've got a hunt coming up this weekend. Yeah. Well, or next, yeah, next, next weekend. weekend. Um, and so she had to shoot her three away. I, I have it zeroed, but she hadn't uh, shot it yet. And she she did a really nice group. It's it's a dead deer out to two hundred. Nice. She's right. Okay. On. How did the grandchild? Uh, Sadie did great. She actually hit the target That's a couple of times, okay. just kind of hip shooting. It. Yeah. That's all she could do. <laughs> what yeah. was her reaction? Loved, Loved it. That's all. Loved it. I mean, she probably put <laughs> twenty rounds through, which is actually more than I thought she would. Yeah. But uh, yeah, she's got. We got her the little earphones. She loved the the flag earphones and stuff like that. <laughs> um, Just but, as a, a quick side yeah. note for anyone who's thinking about getting their kid like a cricket or a rascal, mm-hmm. get the rascal. I would say get neither. Oh, buy the. <laughs> what else is out? So Smith. bad grandfather would do that. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. No, buy the Smith and Wesson uh, M&P 1522. No. On the shortest, you know, the stock collapsed the most yes, or right. whatever. It's a shorter length of pull than that, the, those kitty 22s. I thought that's, but I disagree with you. And then you. they also grow as the kid grows yeah, up so they can Here's why that. the it's, cricket is better. Or not the cricket, the rascal is better. And it depends on the The rascal has group. a feed ramp. It does. Yeah. But can I finish? <laughs> Yeah, but yeah. No, you already yeah. did your turn of what I know, you did with I, guns. No. Just let me. Oh. <clears throat> All right. Honey, a single I, shot oh. is, in my opinion, a better rifle to start a little kid with than a semi-automatic because they will take more time with each shot and they will be more accurate. I've got to disagree. 1911, first gun. <laughs> Should be. <laughs> Always. I agree with you, Jason. And the cricket is actually... 
Not my first choice. I just happened to win it. And the nostalgia uh, and I know, uh, the commitment I that I made. Stan, but the point is... It's a marvelous gun. You uh, did great. <laughs> you done good. So you act, it does not have a feed ramp. It's a single right. shot. You have to actually put it in the, in yeah, the, the breech. In the chamber. And, right. and, and so it takes forward. longer. Yeah. Uh, yeah and I, I wish bet she can't cock it either. She can't. It's, you have to pull that cocking piece back. Yeah. How and the, the trigger? trigger sucks. Was it? She yeah. has to pull with two, two fingers. But she's four and a half. Right. See, so so you slap her until she can get. <laughs> but the, so, but the rascal, so here's the thing: the rascal doesn't have any of those issues. Yeah, yeah. You can. And it's an adjustable trigger. With the M&P 1522, mm -hmm. you can adjust the stock so it actually fits. Mm -hmm. If you want, you could put a light trigger in there. Why are we not saying a Ruger? Because ten twenty two are just feet? like because they're too big. No, it's perfect. I love you can take that sucker and skeletonize it, put it on a plastic squirt gun, and it still works. Mm. <laughs> anyway, but, but that was so. The issue though now I have is three of my kids have twenty twos that they don't even like shooting because they're like little kitty twenty twos. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But and then my that. my son has his fifteen twenty two that I got him, mm -hmm. and it's still cool to shoot it all yeah. and it right. fits him. Good so, even though he's like. Three times but the they're size. also I'm a lot bigger and heavier wins. for them to handle. It's not. Yeah, it is. No, it's not. I have both Those, of them. The 1522s are not heavy. Taco, his children are his. Sons. They're not heavy, but they're they're much longer in the front front to back, and which is going to make it front end heavy for girls. Them. Girls, we're, you're both pretty. <laughs> <laughs> we should. <laughs> so what I would say, what I recommend, like is I said, it take a look on at both what of age them that you're talking and, about and see if you're talking if you're talking about starting a four or five six year old, a cricket or a rascal, they're going to be able to handle it. Much better on their own. No, they can't though because they can't cock that hammer <clears throat> on the on, on the rascal. No, said, on the on the cricket, the rascal doesn't have that hammer. How did say that? The, the rascal doesn't. That. It has a few. Right. Did she load yeah, no, herself? That's what I have. Yeah, I've got two rascals, one cricket, and one fifty or two fifteen twenty twos. Right. And I I'm, think what I'm saying is those guns. They don't grow with the kids as You're they, right. they age. They I don't, and they don't want to shoot their guns this later. Already, <laughs> but it's you buy a gun, and then what do you do? You move on to the next one, buy another gun. It's exactly. called stimulating the economy. It's great for well, everybody. And, and, I donated, and then the grandchildren get it, and then the great grandchildren. I get donated it. it to the NRA, so they got some money too. Uh, she can't aim it, so the concept yeah. is just put it in, and then. Make it go bang, but she loved. I should have bench rested. She well, she she was also helping me reload this morning too. We had to reload some nine millimeter That's fun. for uh, uh, to to shoot, and she's putting the bullet on and helping me pull the handle. So here I'm having a vision right now, Stan in his lazy boy chair with his granddaughter behind him, pulling the handle on the reloader. How are you doing like, back there? <laughs> Did you measure that? I've got the micrometer right there, hon. <laughs> No, she was on my lap right here. <laughs> three <laughs> grains, hon. Three. And, and for the record, she came down voluntarily <laughs> and asked if she could help. I didn't oh, force okay. Her. So yes, I have to cock it. I have to put the the cartridge in. She she figured. I mean, she can do it. She's got those little hands, and she was able good to for do manual it. labor. Yes, yeah. yes. Yeah. But uh, I figure, you know, if this doesn't work out, I'll buy another one, something yeah. else. Yeah. And uh, I've got a grandson. He's four months. So Ooh, better get ready. The, this one can go down to her, and I'll you get. You know her. what cricket he can use. <laughs> yeah, I know. So There's, and I have like one for sale and two rascals for sale. <laughs> yeah, there, there you go. So I, I can get both. But anyway, uh, Ellie shot two, uh, and then her boyfriend was there too, um, and uh, then we shot shotguns. We must have gone through a thousand rounds of shotgun shells. Wow! And uh, like six boxes or four boxes of uh, clay birds and stuff. It was it was fun. We uh, it was almost chaos, but uh, Sadie, bless her heart, was uh, totally in it the whole time and and uh, had a good time. That's good. Cool. Milestone for Papa. It was pretty cool. That's awesome. He didn't take me. That's okay. That's fine. <laughs> well, I was going to take Taco. And, and Is that? Is that Paco said, no, I hate shooting. Don't ever call me again. Leave me alone. I'm a climber. I don't want to do that. Is that what she I said, calls you? She you, calls you Papa? Papa. She does. Papa she does. Stan. No, I said, are you bringing that dang cricket? And you said yes. And I said, I refuse to I go. I refuse to go. <laughs> I will not. So there we go. Awesome. Okay, I'll go fast because we're almost out of time. So today I was working on my Stoger, the double barrel side-by-side -side oh, shotgun. Oh, nice. Nice. And I was, it has an annoyance where, you know, you, as soon as you open it and close it, mm -hmm. then it auto turns on the safety. Yes. 
And then it also sometimes, like after I pull one trigger, uh, the safety will get kind of stuck in between. S- stuck in between. Because yeah. you can, I just you can go up and down and left and right on it, correct? I've had an annoyance too, but she's usually telling me to pick up my crap. <laughs> <laughs> I get the frustration. So, yeah. so anyways, I took it's it apart na- today. It's a navigator. It's a navigator, yeah. yeah. And I, I did a little bit of modifying, uh, grinding on a piece. So you're saying you're a spring. gunsmith. Oh. Not an MG. <clears throat> <clears throat> Wanna be? <laughs> <laughs> Not a master. I'm a, I'm a master Dremel Smith. Ooh, ooh yeah. even better. <laughs> yeah. So, anyways, I now the safety it still works. Yeah. You just have to. It doesn't auto turn on, and I am much happier with it. That's cool. Huh. So I did that. I made some 20 practical ammo, necking down some 223 to 20 cal. I uh, hope to. The, were you able to do that yourself with your your manly hands? You you didn't need some some smaller hands to help. Because we know a like, granddaughter that. Could well, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, know, I was going to say saying, I, I could have borrowed <coughs> Carl. You could have used. Oh Carl. yeah, yeah. Yeah, this will work. Not not my yeah. little. Uh, great Carl, Carl's he, got bifocals five now. seven. He can he can load. A, That's right. He can ride twenty, load 20 practical. practical. <laughs> yeah. I've, and awesome. I've learned the pre- the pleasures of uh, aging. I, yeah. I now need to buy. Actually. I was watching masses, one of his uh, commercial, uh, not commercials, his little shorts. YouTubes. On putting the bifocal, bifocal on the top. On the yeah. top mm-hmm. of the glasses. Mark used to talk about that a lot, too. G- guess what I'm ordering is yeah. that, huh. just so I can see the sights. Progressives or uh, li- the lines? The line. Okay. Like a man. Okay. Mm. Okay. I draw the line. I walk the line. Okay. Six Creedmoor. So, Ooh. been playing around with that a little bit, too. Oh, you've given up on our no our, our <coughs> the twenty two Creedmoor? Creedmoor. Are you unloading? I was waiting for a chance when Stan would actually go shooting when he said <laughs> hey, he would well, go well, shooting. Wait a minute! Yeah. Wait a minute. Uh, have you shot your twenty two Creedmoor yet? I have not. Uh, I've been waiting I, to shoot I it have, with you. Do you have, have do you have a six five Creedmoor? Six five six and twenty two. Creedmoor. 220, 220. I'm trying to collect all the Creed. I'm looking to get, like, everyone around me is shooting the rifle, so I'm like, I'm So if someone says, you know, they shout out, hey, you got some Creedmoor ammo? I'll be like, Which yes. ones? Yeah. <laughs> all of them. <laughs> all of them. <laughs> yeah. uh, although, Taco, it's now PRC. Uh, Creedmoor is so yesterday. <laughs> so I'm not on the PRC boat. Not yet? No. Because mm-hmm. uh, for the distances I shoot, those three calibers do fine. And one of them would do everything that you'd possibly need. You you don't need all three of them. Yeah, probably. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, much like three fourths of all of our gun collection. Yeah. Gee, uh, I keep looking at the old two seventy, just two seventy Winchester. Oh, that's or thirty out six. It did everything. Uh, two seventy with <clears throat> the new modern bullets, yeah. the high BC bullets. Oh, yeah. That's a great yeah. cartridge for you know long long distance shooting or hunting or whatever you yeah. know. Well, apparently it is the ordained caliber six point eight because the military is going to it. They've gone to it. The six point eight free, uh, fury or two seven seven fury. Yeah. Yeah. So anyway, anyways, we're out of time. Yeah. Oh, is there anything else? Thank goodness. Do you oh. need another snack, Carl? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> would you Gosh. would you care for some milk? <laughs> would you like some milk? <laughs> we have the milk candy, remember? No. Yeah, actually, milk. that wasn't bad. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it wasn't bad. <laughs> it was boring, though. It was. What else did she say? Would you care for some milk? Some overtine. Overtine. <laughs> <laughs> Frau Blucher. <laughs> Sorry. I think half of our shows are always just movie quotes. Yeah. 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 <laughs> okay. Well, until next time, stay safe, have fun. Hopefully, I'll, I'll have more to report on next time. I don't think I have a choice. I have to shoot. Yeah. yeah. Get out and take somebody shooting. Lesbian pants? <laughs> Dude, not lesbian so pants. I, I don't know. These if, ones, uh, they're like parachute material, and I UPS has not caught me yet. I hate to I wear these nonstop. Get trapped in Like, I spot. love these things. What, I what, understand. What kind are those? I think there's a ready, ready, ready <laughs> Bowers. <laughs> <laughs> does it say, does it say Eddie Bowers? Hey, oh. Stan, don't oh. point that at anything you're not oh. willing to destroy. <laughs> 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 yeah.
Oh, to dude. maim or destroy. <laughs> Boy, that that I lesbian. Was, I was referring to you being bent over. Oh, in front like of taco. the yeah. le- the lesbianism sounds pretty good now. You know, I almost feared for my life. 